undetected footprints. We are talking about Caleb Harris. After a month-long search, remains found at a wastewater facility in Texas. The DNA samples were sent to the University of North Texas Center for Human Identification for analysis with Harris parents' DNA. The remains were approximately 2.46 trillion times more likely to be observed if the unidentified remains originated from a, from a biological child of Caleb Harris's parents, rather than if the unidentified remains originated from an unrelated individual from the Caucasian population, according to the missing person's DNA report. His family says, We all have heavy hearts this evening as we've learned of the positive identification of our sweet Caleb. We will grieve our son. Harris family said, thank you for your prayers and support during this tragic time. Caleb was only 21 years old when he went missing in March. Forensic scientists in Corpus Christi police have determined the human remains found inside of a wastewater station just last month are in fact those of Caleb Harris, the missing college student from New Braunfels. A discovery was made on June the 24th. Those remains having to be analyzed by DNA after the medical examiner's office couldn't make a positive ID. Harris disappeared from his apartment back on March the 4th. Police in Corpus Christi, the Coast Guard, and many other agencies working in search and recovery efforts since his disappearance. The investigation in this case, however, remains ongoing. In a statement from Caleb's father, Randy Harris, the family says, quote, we have heavy hearts this evening as we learned of the positive identification of our sweet Caleb. We will grieve our son, but we are at peace knowing he is with our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Our only hope is in Jesus. If you don't know our Savior, please talk to me. I love talking about Jesus. Thank you for your prayers and support during this tragic time. His roommates were unable to locate him after he walked his dog early in the morning and his family reported him missing. Caleb's father, Randy, told ABC Corpus Christi that his dog returned home, but his son never did. He left behind his keys, wallet, and vehicle. He did have his phone, but had been turned off. In the months since Caleb's disappearance, investigators executed over 50 digital search warrants, submitted 82 preservation requests, and analyzed over 1,500 gigabytes of data. The investigation into his death remains open. It's very sad to know that he couldn't be found alive. That's awful for parents to go through. But now they can have closure and have time to grieve. Let us all pray for them. Hopefully the investigators can find out what caused his death.